welcome back to my another YouTube video. My name is your Emperor Yuki, and today we're doing another Minecraft Demand Block tutorial. But anyhow, before we start our video, once again hit the subscribe button as usual and slap the bell icon and always be notified every time I uploaded such video and stuff. But anyhow, let's go right to it and let's get started in our Demand Block tutorial. <laughs> Alright, before we start to our video guys, I wanna say that there might be a lot of noisy background in our video But I wanna say sorry to you in advance and I want you guys to don't mind all the noisy backgrounds and just focus in our command block But now we can see the command block just activated, I just enchant the spell command But anyhow, before we start our video guys, um, follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Facebook and any kind of Twitter But anyhow, let's go right to it and let's get started But today we're gonna show you guys, I'm gonna teach you guys the command block tutorial which actually you can enchant the power spell powerful spell in minecraft that can uh, protect you and can uh, actually it's just gonna protect you from harm harmful things but you can actually use this to any kind of maps even for a hostile map so i'm just gonna show you first we're gonna get some husk and let's go get some husk So basically what we're gonna do is you can see all these husk in here and it's actually survival and you wanna fight all these husks. Basically you're just gonna enchant the spell, you're gonna go near to them, you're gonna Surprise mo boom just like that. So basically what we're gonna do is you're gonna summon the iron golem on fire and which can ignite anyone on fire. Oh crap! Fire too. You can see them it ignites all the powerful fire. And once this thing oh I actually broke it. Actually, it won't work if you broke. So you better not broke this thing. Look at this. So once this thing reach to this command box, it will disappear all the um, iron golem. So you better uh, make sure this redstone or your redstone repeater won't go broke or you won't get broken. Cause actually, be crappy laggy. Cause it won't. It won't gonna resume on them in after you summon all the um, iron golems. So basically, what we're gonna do is you can see this. So basically, what we're gonna do to enchant the spell is face downward and jump, <laughs> boom, and yeah. You can see them. It's get killed, killed, killed. After that, when it reaches there and they vanishes. So that's how the enchantment spell work. So I'm gonna teach you the command blocks right now. Oops, what did I just did in there? So just like this I guess so it actually works to non hostile mobs too you can see this of course it's not a hostile mob but if you face downward and jump but basically the iron golem won't kill the horse because it's not a hostile creature but it will set the horse on fire and it's still gonna summon some iron golem though so basically when you jump upward without the mobs nearby it's just gonna chop just like nothing and no iron golem will summon but you can just have you really have um, jump boost and your resistance so you won't get hurt when you are target in a survival mode but if locked if you go nearby to any kind of mobs just like this cow and you jump and boom you can see all oh, got set on fire and it's human the iron golem which vanishes directly after this thing which is in here but anyhow let's go right to it and let's get started in our command block tutorial there's so much noises right now so i wanna do i wanna get some chickens to you right now because i really wanna hear all the chickens outside but anyhow let's go right to it so we got here our first ever command block so you better make sure it points right toward in there and the other three points toward in there too then after make them point toward in there and you're gonna put the redstone comparator which actually oops actually point right in there and you compare i mean this is a razor repeater right and it points right in there and this one also points right forward in there but basically this tree will actually point right in there too but the other command blocks which actually go circulate this thing comparator is actually gonna point right here and i put the one two three four five six I, it doesn't actually matter how quick oops i just summon a lot of iron gum so it doesn't actually matter how many redstone but i just put a lot of redstone in here you can see all this redstone repeater repeater red repeater i just put a lot so it will take a long time before the uh, iron golem vanishes so the iron golem can protect you before they vanish but that's how it is now let's go right into our first key member we got here chain and code shell and always active with execute at erxm80 uh comma rx equals 90 triple the effect at erxm equals 80 rx 90 then close the bracket and stand health space one 
one than two but it's chain unconditional and always active now for our second command lock we got here a second formula put it to chain and conditional and always active now once again execute add a rx m equals 80 rx 90 3 tilde then put a detect 2 tilde without the space put in negative 2 then another tilde grass 0 execute at e type equals quotation mark player then comma type equals quotation mark iron golem then comma r equals 10 then comma c equals 11 then close bracket 3 tilde simon iron golem our third command block, we got here a third command block. So basically, we could execute R A R X N equals 80 R X plus 90 once again. Three tilde detect, two tilde without space to the two, then tilde grass here. Execute R E type equals quotation mark player, then comma type equals quotation mark and golem, then another comma R equals 10, three tilde and set black. Now put it to uh, repeat and control any redstone. Well, you just shut the flip up <laughs> So that's how things works. Now let's go right to our fourth command that put it to you. Impulse, unconditional, and need redstone. Wait, wait, I'm gonna show you. Repeat, unconditional, and need redstone. Now let's go back to our normal command lock. Impulse, unconditional, and need redstone. Add that is just gonna kill the iron golem. So it's gonna put slash kill at E type equals iron golem. Now for our fifth command lock. We got here our execute at ARXM equals 80, comma RX equals 90, triple the effect at ARXM once again equals to 80, then once again RX equals to 90, triple the resistance, space 1, 10, then 2, repeat, and conditional, and always active. Now to our last command block, we got execute at ARXM equals 80, comma RX equals 90, triple the effect at ARXM equals 18, comma RX equals 90, then uh, jump. And uh, put the underscore then boost one space ten then true. They put it to repeat and conditional and always active. Now there you have it. You got your own enchanting spell or you got your own casting spell in Minecraft, which actually summon e bodyguard and also set the nearby mobs on fire. Wait, boom! You can see that. So it actually. Um, I'm not so sure, but I actually gonna summon the exact iron number of iron golem. Of the exact number which you have nearby maps actually you can see there's only one and when you jump it's summoned only one but actually it's summoned I don't know how it's summoned to it's actually because of this line it's summoned to because there's actually a slime nearby so, but if you only have one map you actually gonna summon only one iron golem and if you have two or three maps you actually gonna summon the exact number of iron golem but anyhow I think that will be it for our video today because actually still have online class you know so yeah that will be it for video today thanks for watching and I'm sorry that I haven't yet uploaded recently because I've been busy for my school and yeah Let's end this video and I hope you enjoy. Better hit the subscribe button right now, jump below, slap the bell icon, and always be notified every time I've uploaded such video and stuff. But anyhow, let's end this video and follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. But that'll be it for our video today. Thank you for watching once again. So, yeah, peace out, bye bye, have fun, enjoy, and also stay safe from COVID 19. But yeah, that'll be it for our video today. Love you all, peace out, peace, peace, peace.